little shark found that fossils are special characters in history book. It kept the skeleton and outline of ancient creatures very intact. Through fossils, scientists have discovered that in the late Cretaceous period, which was 65 million years ago, the fifth mass extinction in Earth's history happened. Three quarters of the species were erased from Earth. The most notorious species of this extinction is dinosaurs. Why did dinosaurs suddenly disappear? How did the fifth mass extinction happen? This has been a major unsolved mystery in the history of biology. There are numerous interpretations by scientists. One typical earlier hypothesis is Cuvier's catastrophism. His theory was 65 million years ago, Earth was full of volcanoes. Dinosaurs could not bear the temperature and died out naturally. And later, climatologists suggested that it was the dramatic climate change that led to the extinction of dinosaurs. However, some climatologists believed that the era of Earth became too hot, while some thought that Earth was too cold. By 1977, Alvarez and his son found new geological evidences, and they made a shocking hypothesis of the asteroid impact, which took the world by surprise. This hypothesis may sound whimsical, but it has now become the mainstream doctrine in the field of paleontology. Although the dinosaurs are extinct, people have fantasized about dinosaurs' resurrection. There was a time that, in the deep swamp of the Congo Republic in Africa, there were rumors about living dinosaurs living there. Are the dinosaurs really extinct? In 1857, scientists Huxley put forward a bold hypothesis that the ancestor of a bird is dinosaur. But that is only a hypothesis. Until 1996, Chinese dragon bird was discovered. This just filled the gap between dinosaurs and birds. Even so, scientists still have not reached a consensus. The origin of birds and the extinction of dinosaurs is a mystery. Long before the discovery of the Chinese dragon bird, several versions of the Archaeopteryx fossils had been discovered. And whether it was Archaeopteryx or Cynosaurusopteryx, they all have a critical common feature. Their bodies were covered with feathers. British scientists have proven that Archaeopteryx with feathers could indeed fly. Anyway, who is the ancestor of birds? Where did dinosaurs finally go? Although these have become mysteries, but Little Shark believes that in the near future, all these questions will have answers.